What if I tell you there are seven to eight chapters in the entire physics, which if you study, you can get 140 plus in your physics by learning these chapters only. Extremely important, okay, when it comes to those toppers who get good rank, who score very well in physics, they basically start with these chapters only. And that's the reason we call it do or die chapters of physics. So my dear friends, I would want you guys to focus over here completely. I will tell you how you guys are approach, how you guys are supposed to approach these particular chapters and what you guys are supposed to study over here, how you have to make the formula sheet each and every single thing. Because these are the chapters which will help you to score 180 out of 180 in your physics, okay? And by learning these six to seven or seven to eight chapters, I would definitely say that you can score one, we say, one one uh, 40 plus okay and and i have previously given the proof already in many other videos or a in a video day before yesterday in which i have clearly told you how many questions have been asked from these particular chapters every single year so let's dive into the video and make sure you hit the like button i would want you guys to hit it right now okay and do share this video with your friends if you are starting your preparation please make sure you start with these chapters because as I have been telling you at the initial stage, we say the energy of the students is extremely higher. So I would want you guys to use that energy in learning these chapters so that you can gain maximum score so that you can go on to the safer side. So the first one is that is modern physics, be it your J, be it your NEET. We say modern physics is a gold mine. Okay. So we say every single year, every single year, I would say 13 to 15 questions, 13 to 15 questions. If not 13 to 15 questions, we say if we take a minimum of, I would say 10 questions you can expect from this particular portion of physics, modern physics. And it's extremely small. You have got in this particular one, you have got dual nature of matter and radiations. This is one chapter. Atoms and nuclei is another chapter and semiconductors is another chapter. So my dear friends, you can expect 10 questions from this portion. 10 multiplied by 4, that is 40 marks from the modern physics only, okay? This is the minimum I am saying. It can go up to 13 also. So I would recommend you to follow this. I would recommend you to study this. And when it comes to the dual nature of matter and addition, it's an extremely small chapter. Extremely small chapter. We say from this one, radioactivity is removed okay radioactivity was a bigger part over here and rest of the things over there you have which are extremely easy and if if i have covered the modern complete modern physics in marathon in just 11 hours i guess okay so in 11 hours i have completed this modern physics you can watch that lecture also so i would recommend you to basically study from these particular chapters okay and in semiconductors we say transistor is removed so if that is removed means half of the semiconductors over there is removed. So what is there? Nothing. So you can study these chapters and you can get the 40 marks, 40 to 50 marks from the modern physics portion only. Now guys, next we move on to and what you are supposed to study in this one. We say the theory must be done properly. You guys are supposed to remember, learn every single concept over here. The conceptual clarity has to be very strong because we are expecting in the upcoming NEET 2025, the difficulty level, they may increase. So for that reason, you guys have to make it very strong. Okay. And then all previous year questions must be done. You'll have to solve all previous year questions in this particular portion. Okay. So whatever they have asked till now from NEET 2013 onwards, you will have to solve all of those. And then we have, we have, you have to make the formula sheet because there are a lot of formulas in the, in the, what we call uh, modern physics. So you'll have to make the separate formula sheet and, and, and I would recommend you to make the revision notes also, revision notes also, because this is also mandatory and this is also important to make the revision notes also, my dear friends. This will help you at the end moment when you revise the entire modern physics in just, we say, five to ten minutes. And then next we'll move on to the portion that is what we call the electrostatics. And in electrostatics, we say four to five questions are confirmed. If you check from the in the past years, 
every single year they have been asking from uh, this particular chapter four to five questions okay even in the recent year also four questions were asked so it is really easy okay it, uh, it consists of we say three portions electric charge and fields electric potential and capacitance okay and what you are supposed to do over here previous year questions are extremely important that must be done you guys are supposed to do the theory also the complete theory over here okay and and make the formula sheet in this one also because it's a vast it's a big chapter there are a lot of formulas that you guys have to remember so that's why you'll have to make the separate formula sheet in this one also as well as the revision notes okay extremely important we say and extremely easy it is not difficult at all so you can definitely learn this one then you have got the kinematics when it comes to the kinematics my dear friends this particular chapter this particular chapter over here it is very easy we have been studying the kinematics from we say ninth class so you can basically learn this and in this one you have one dimensional motion two dimensional motion and relative motion in relative motion rain man problem and the river boat problem is important and when it comes to one dimensional motion you have the equations of motion and average velocity they might ask the questions from average velocity or equations of motion or or they might ask the questions from the graphs, position time graph, velocity time graph, or acceleration time graph, or the graph conversion also. So that's the reason I would recommend you to learn this also very, very carefully. And then you have got the Newton's laws of motion. Two questions you can expect from this particular chapter also. Extremely easy. Just you have to make the ABD over here, Newton's three laws and the ABD, and you have got the pseudo force. And that's it. You have gotten the Newton's laws of motion. And afterwards, current electricity, extremely important. Four to five questions you can expect from this particular portion also, okay? And what is important over here? You have important over here, drift velocity, okay? Resistance, whatever, if we change the length of a conductor, how the resistance will change, okay? What is the different relations with the drift velocity? And measuring instruments, like you have meter bridge, volt meter, a meter, all of that you have to remember in this one, okay? And then you have the optics. Optics, people say this is a bit difficult, but it is not. It is also formula based. If you make a proper notes and if you learn this in a sequence, every single thing will be sorted. Okay. You would be able to uh, basically achieve your goal. That's for sure with this one also. Okay. Make sure you make a proper formula sheet. And then you have the thermodynamics. You can expect two to three questions from this chapter also. Very easy. You because you study thermodynamics and chemistry also and gravitation two to three questions you can expect over here and 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 this one that is units and dimensions people feel units and dimensions is a small chapter who is going to ask the questions from this portion guys let me tell you you look at the past papers you see every single year they have been asking three to four questions and it's an extremely small chapter just you have the dimensional analysis over here and you have those measuring instruments over here that is vernier caliber screw gauge you have to learn those and you'll get these we say 12 to 16 marks from this particular portion from this particular chapter so my dear friends 140 plus you can score with these chapters if you learn these in physics so i would highly recommend you to study this has to be your first priority because this is the do or die chapters of physics now my dear friends one more point i would want to Ed over here, sir, is there any batch where you guys teach these chapters first? I say yes, that is this Phoenix batch, okay? Pro we have recently launched and I would want you guys to join it as soon as possible because, because we have started, we have started with these portions, the, these chapters only, okay? In physics and in chemistry, we have started with the high weightage chapters and in biology also. So join it as soon as possible. It is right now for 5,999 rupees. The link is in the description below. Click on to that link and join it as soon as possible. Next, my dear friends, there is something that is what we call the Unacademy Pro, okay? What is this Unacademy Pro? Unacademy Pro is a lot of students out there want to learn online, but they want to give the test series offline because they feel that if we give the test series offline, we would be able to achieve good marks in the NEET examination. It will benefit us. It will help us. So that is only possible with the help of the Unacademy Pro, this subscription. You can have the offline revision classes. You can have the offline 
doubt solving. You can have the offline test experience. You can have the live mentorship sessions. You can have the physical notes. All of these features are in the Pro. You can definitely see what is the difference between Plus, Iconic and Pro. Accordingly, you can choose your subscription. And when it comes to the Phoenix Pro, let me tell you, study material, uh, be it mentorship sessions or be it VC test series, everything is included over there. So if you haven't joined that, I would want you guys to join it as soon as possible. So take care and bye-bye. And guys, guys, please do do like this particular video and do share this particular video. Thank you so much. Take care and bye-bye.